So much of the questioning was done on the phone. Um, ah, this is part vlog number four because this thing keeps cutting me off. So I go in. Um, the receptionist area is covered in glass between where they receive me and um, where she's sitting. Uh, she puts on gloves whenever she has to, you know, touch other things. Puts on a mask whenever she has to have contact with people. Um, asked me to open up the door. And so I did. I went into the waiting room. And I showed you guys the picture there. Um, and the all, all they basically did was, it was like the flu test. They took something and they stuck it up my nose. And they took a sample from inside my nose. They rubbed it against my skin. And then they put it into a little, a little jar, a little vial. And then that was it. Um, the person that was testing me was all covered up. Uh, had a doctor's, not a doctor's coat, but uh, like scrubs and something else covering him. And a sheet covering his face and a plastic thing also covering his face. And I was in there in and out maybe five minutes at the most. And they told me that they did that to uh, reduce exposure. So there was no one in the waiting room. I think they scheduled specific times where it's one person. And there was only one, one other person um, waiting in front of the receptionist desk where probably she was waiting for her ride or something like that. And that was it. It was very clinical, very clean, not a good experience, not a bad experience. That was an experience. That was it. Um, so like I said today, I spent the day home and I'm feeling better and I will keep you updated uh, on my progress and anything new that I learn and I will post another video tomorrow. All right. Thanks for all your comments. Thanks for your support, your encouragement. I love you guys so much. I miss most of you. Um, give me a call, send me a text, keep in touch. And if you're experiencing the same things, keep your head up. You got this. Okay? Bye. Thank you for listening.